Governor Bruce Rauner recently gave his 2018 state budget address, filled with concern about a declining Illinois population. So we checked in with local officials to see how Naperville is stacking up to the rest of the state. Naperville News 17's Beth Bria has the details. State population was on Governor Bruce Rauner's mind at his 2018 budget address. And make no mistake, we are in a competition and the states around us are winning at our expense. They have out-legislated us, and now they are outgrowing us. Rauner says the state is losing people in search of lower taxes to surrounding states. So we checked in on the population of Naperville, where the story is quite different. We continue to have new homes that are built in new areas of the city. Uh, even areas that we never thought would be built, uh, say for instance the Country Lakes Golf Course when that was converted over to 300 homes. That's why the city of Naperville has decided to hold a special census this year, earlier than the regular census to be held in 2020. Well, that's great for the city when we realize that we can get additional uh, state taxes from the, from the state for each uh, person that lives in the city. Officials believe that since the last census, the population has grown by four to 5,000 people. Over the next year and a half, that would bring in an additional $1.6 million from the state in income tax, use tax, and motor fuel tax, which are distributed based on population. The greater our population, the more we get, which helps drive down our uh, property tax rate. Areas being counted are mainly in the northwest and southwest sides of the city, where there's new housing. For Naperville News 17, I'm Beth Bria. Naperville's special census begins February 23rd.